Hello. All right, you guys. Welcome to another stream. <coughs> this isn't necessarily the gameplay. Um, uh, we're here. Uh, so I just unboxed my stream deck. Uh, downloaded the software. Um, but I kind of just wanted to show and maybe if you guys have already set one up. Uh, if you guys can give me some tips, because there's a lot. I was going over everything, looking at stuff, and I was like, this is a lot. So make a little stream of it um, and just take you guys along the way. If you guys have any tips or any, um, you know, keys that you guys recommend that are good for somebody streaming on Twitch, um, just let me know. Um, but this is on their website right here. I have it pulled up. As you can see. Um, so you can make stream deck keys and I thought this was, this is just amazing because they also have all these plugins with their app that you download the software. So, um, it's kind of giving me a tutorial step by step. So I thought, Hey, um, I'll just go over it with you guys and you know, we'll go along together. Um, so it says first add an image of your own or click one below. Um, so right now, I know you guys can't see it, but my stream deck, all it shows is the very middle button with the Elgato symbol, and then it'll change and has a little welcome. Um, when I plugged it in, uh, it showed the Elgato logo, like through all the keys, like all together as one picture. Um, and then once I downloaded the software, or no, um, once it was plugged in, you know, opened up, you know, slobs, I opened up Wavelink, um, Spotify, so I'm having to do all that. Um, the blue button in the middle pops up, it says welcome, well I push that, it actually opened me up to this website right here. Um, so welcome to the stream deck, uh, it opens you up to this uh, page right here, um, so it says get ready to re revolutionize your workflow. And just like this, like, there's so much going on um, for this stream. So obviously they use um, uh, the other uh, streaming source, but that's okay. They actually have this right here. So rather use OBS Streamlabs to um, display your content. Um, they also have XSplit. I'm not sure what that is. Uh, 4K Capture Utility. Uh, they got Twitch, I kind of watched that a little bit, uh, Twitter, and YouTube. Uh, um, 
so let's see but basically it just walks you through um, a couple of uh, keys uh, that you can use from like Streamlabs and what can go in there um, yeah so it has direct so obviously the little uh, streaming now and then go into the gameplay you know you got your scenes which it shows you um, and then you got mixer audio so you can mute unmute your audio sources um, then it kind of shows that there's the three of them right there um, let's see and then start and end your broadcast um, with touching the record button um, it just shows it being dragged in there and how to set it up and then this one is source but there's a lot there's a lot and this is this is amazing hi Jasmine Jasmine wanted to say hi already you could have been my other one I was on the floor you were being lazy yeah I know um, but no, I just, there's just so much, um, see the brightness. Yeah, the, obviously this screen's white, so that's why my face is like super bright right now. Um, but yeah, I just, I mean, this stream's not going to be too long. I'm just kind of going to, going to go over it and, um, you know, create some keys, uh, and we'll see. Um, but they do have like, um, you know, the question page and then they do feature um these are pictures from the community um if you guys let's see if they still have it i actually sent them one of my pictures with the wave three here let's see if uh my picture's on there so yeah as you scroll down the page this is what it does let's see uh mine was there Jazz, man. They probably change them out, I guess, but mine, my picture was right here on the community tab. It's actually on their Instagram, so, um, or is it on the pop filter? Let's check here. Yeah, they, I'm sure they, you know, switch them in and out. Yeah, it looks like they do. Okay. Okay, key creator, where we were. Jazz, man. Um, let's see. So, let's just do, let's just do this one right here, like a, like a audio one. Okay, so this is what it's going to look like. This is like the PNG file or something. So obviously you want to, you know, upload your own. You guys seen that, um, it lets you choose your own image. Uh, what's wallpaper mode? Okay, so it looks like it can cover all these keys right here for you. Oh my gosh, this is just, this is so much to take in. I am just, this is, and then it looks like it has a little preview window for you. Um, yeah, let's just go, oh, you can overlap them? <laughs> let's not do that. There we go. So you can change the color as well. Let's give it the blue here. Huh. Save key. Oh, looks like it downloads it. Okay, so that's all. I guess you just create the, looks like the, Jasmine, yeah. Uh, you just create the uh, key displayed there. So that's pretty cool. I thought maybe you could like, make the key and then uh, customize what it does but let's see Ouch. dog what are you doing what are you doing uh, and this is, you know, the setup. 
You got actions, multi actions, folders, different profiles, um, icons, and accounts. Um, obviously, not going to watch them because I want to bore you guys. But let's take a look at the. This is the software pulled up. Um, as you can tell, it's right down here. It's got the 15 little keys on it. And this one right here is Wavelink. I already have it opened. Um, it's on my left screen. It's not like on my screen. I usually have Streamlabs OBS, the only thing opened on the left. But this is your interface. This is what it's going to look like. Um, yeah, I was just checking this out. Um, also, if you click right here, this is the Stream Deck store. So I was looking through this and I was like, this is literally amazing. Like uh, discover, like protect yourself from hate raids. Um, not sure what that really is. Looks like they got like monthly updates on like new plugins they have come in. But uh, if you hit the plugins tab right here, there's all of these. So all these are right in here. Or you could just go, okay, I want an audio plugin or I want developer. So developing stuff, engagement, so they have a Streamlabs dashboard uh, for that button, like there is uh, stream loot, slow up your stream, um, yeah, there's a lot, um, there's finance, <laughs> looks like, like Bitcoin and stuff, crypto, oh my gosh, uh, so we got games, so there's like live controls for games, like this is this is the next level of like, and like this Minecraft one, Minecraft stats, uh, get stats of your favorite Minecraft server live on stream deck. So right here on these little tiles, you're going to be getting Minecraft stats. Who, who, who would have thought? Um, and they actually have like little games. Yeah. Like there's this dice game. There's like a memory game. Yeah, Stream Deck game, Soup game with your Stream Deck. Like, what? You got Dice Roller, you got Pac-Man, <laughs> Snake, Hangman, Puzzles, Tic-Tac-Toe, Minesweeper, Simon Says, Breakout, and 8-Ball. <laughs> oh, you can display on stream. Oh, okay, that makes sense. I was like, if you can literally play this on the Stream Deck, like, no one's going to stream anymore. <laughs> but... Yeah, interactive. So, like, with certain games, I have certain plugins. Like, this is for the Minecraft Flight Simulator. Um, Stream Raiders. Battle. Like, what? This is in, like, 8-Ball. Eight, eight Magic 8-Ball. You can ask it questions. <laughs> and there's lighting. Like, the, um, the Nano Leafs you can control right here. I'm probably going to get some of those. My wife was um, looking into that. I'm actually going to try and get the like the soundproof panels. Um, they're just some off, off Amazon. We'll see how they do. Um, but Elgato does have their own panels, um, which looks super cool. But um, for right now, um, I'll probably just try some Amazon ones. They look pretty cool. They're like, um, it's a square one. It's all black. Um, it has like three, nine little like almost spikes coming out. Um, if I, if I get them in or if I end up getting them, I'll, I'll show you guys and let you guys know. But, um, yeah, there's just, look at this, obviously the Spotify one, um, you guys are probably aware of, um, you just click it and boom, your Spotify is playing or it's, you know, brought up on the stream deck, um, smart home, the thermostat, you control your thermostat from this, like, and then social media. I thought this one was super cool. Um, there's like a YouTube ticker, a uh, direct link to your favorite YouTube channel, YouTube channel stats of your YouTube channel, uh, Twitch, you can control Twitch. Um, I'm not sure what that one was. Um, and this is utilities, so like there's a clock, a uh, Windows movie, and riser uh, there's a counter check number of times you press a key 
Not sure why anyone would want to do that. Uh, CPU usage, so that'd be kind of cool. Um, just a lot of great different tools, like a speed test, just in case you guys want to see how your net speed's doing. Um, the battery shows the battery of your Logitech G Hub. Um, so I do have a Logitech uh, Light Speed, what the 302, 502, whatever it is, um, keyboard that's wireless, all that. Um, I'm actually thinking about getting the um, Logitech Light Speed headphones, or like wireless, two different ones. Uh, I actually have one for pre order. Uh, it's a little bit on the cheaper side, it's like 80 bucks. Um, but they're actually made out of plastic uh, recycled material. Um, I've seen Logitech posted up on their Instagram, and they got tons of different colors. You know how everybody is about their colors. Um, I think they had a really cool like black one or purple one. Um, so maybe something like that. Or they have uh, the light speed. Um, it's like an all black one, wireless. Uh, that one's like 120. Um, but we'll see. Um, because these... These just plug into my mic right here. Um, I've had these for probably six years. Um, they do fine. They're great. You know, I got the different new cushions, so that's everything solved there. But uh, just something maybe it's wireless because sometimes I get tangled up in this cord. Um, you know, it's long enough where my hand can go over it or around it. But um, just something that'd be wireless. I hook just straight up Bluetooth would be super cool. Um, and that way my mic, I can kind of position it where I want, maybe to the right of me. Um, and then that would be that. So, but yeah, let me know, um, maybe what headset you guys use and what's good for gaming and stuff. I just, I mean, I'm not complaining about the audio for these, these, you know, used to be like $200, uh, $300, like DJ headphones is like, you know, obviously six years ago. Uh, now you can get them for like maybe a hundred bucks. Um, but still they, they, you know, I think I've used them for so long that maybe the sound quality has gone down. Cause mm. I used to like ride my bike. Um, it's probably why the ear muffs, ear cushions were like super worn out. It's cause I used to have to bike to work to my first job, um, across town and, you know, 10, you know, uh, maybe not even 10, maybe like 15 to 30 minute bike ride. Um, if that, <laughs> um, you know, every day back and forth, um, whether it's hot out or cold out, I was wearing them, um, and I would even take them into work, you know, it was a little sketchy, but everyone there was cool and everything, but, um, yeah, I just need to maybe upgrade the headphones next, so, um, but yeah, the Elgato mic arm, low profile, that one would be super cool, um, I think it would tie my setup together, um, and maybe a different desk, um, this one kind of feels a little bit small for what I'm trying to do, but it's fine. It works. Uh, it's nice for me. So, but yeah, and then got a little icons. Um, well, it's like an icon pack is what they are. And I'm surprised you don't have to pay for them because they got like Photoshop. Mm. So like if you guys do photo edits, video edits, like the stream deck is for you, like you don't need to be a streamer just to use it. And look, there's like 70 different icons. Um, yeah, when building your Photoshop Stream Deck profile, if you want to build your own, we've done it for you. Full packs, including pre-built profiles. So you can just like, I guess, buy a profile and then it's going to upload all of the um, tiles you want and the actions for you. So boom, you don't have to do it. Which would be super cool. And it looks like they got music. So you can put in some music if you want. It's kind of cool. And then some sound effects. Um, but I won't get into that too much. Um, but yeah, if you click right up here. Uh, devices, Stream Deck. So like, they do have a mobile version of the Stream Deck. Um, I believe you have to pay for it. Yeah, I think there's like a month, like a subscription thing. But um, here's the different profiles. Wavelength 1, 2, new profile, edit profiles. Um, and then we're going to go to the right over here. So, um, looks like we got scenes. Can I drag it over? Oh, okay, okay. What if I want to... Oh, here we go. 
That is so cool. Yeah, just look at all these different little buttons. Like the fact that you can customize it to to where, how you want, when you want, where you want. Like, look, this thing's already on the stream deck. I know you guys can't. Look at that. Is that good? Yeah, that's the scene one I just dragged over, and it's already on there. That is just amazing. All right, let's see. Yeah, can we get rid of this welcome one? Delete. Yeah, so it looks like it just brings up the website. It's like a link. Are you sure you want to delete this icon? Try this. There we go. And boom. It's just away from the stream deck now. So we got start and stop recording. I'm not going to get that one because I don't really use that from um, slobs. I just download the um, the Twitch stream. Uh, stream. Start and stop live streaming. See, they got all your stuff for OBS Studio. They got your stuff for Streamlabs. Um, so we're actually going to get rid of this one. And then, just can, oh, let's add this one. So it's all, it actually matches, like, because obviously slobs is, like, green. So it actually matches that. And then, got source, sources. I think I'm good there. Um... You got voice mods, you got Twitch Studio, you got Wave Link. So, no, I want to open it up. Oh, okay, look, okay, so this one is my starting soon, and then I can either have it be right back or stream ending. Is there a way to group them? No, I just want to... Oh, okay, you can make them different. What if I do add? Okay. Okay, so we got starting soon, and then stream ending, and then this one's going to be obviously gameplay, and we're going to switch this, or we could just do that one. Or not. <coughs> there we go. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh. I just watched it like drag over on the stream deck. Oh, move to folder. Let's do that. So, uh, 
I don't want separate ones. Oh, you can't control Z anything? Huh. Oh, okay, okay. Let's do this. So we got starting soon. Boom. Here we go. Oh, and it opens it up. So, yeah, whatever is displayed right here is what's on your stream deck right there. Just wow. So starting soon. And we got be right back. And then we got stream ending. And then we got our gameplay. Wowzers. So I'm gonna choose that one to be my gameplay. Please. Okay, there we go. Gameplay, and then we got ending. Oh, it's so cool. So we got, oh my gosh, and as I'm typing, it's popping up on there. It's so cool. And we got B, be right back. Ah, I see, but. It looks a little funky. So, we just gonna put BRB. BRB. And this one, starting. Starting, BRB ending. Okay. Now, let's see. Should have like pre done. They probably have them. I don't like this though. I don't like the folder look. Um, maybe. <coughs> maybe I have a scene one. And then I could type in. Um, scene, scenes, whoa, there we go, nice, all right, Let's see what happens if I push this. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, see that? That was easy. Oh my gosh, what a breeze. Wow. Well, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this stream. I know it wasn't any gameplay, probably boring to most of you, but I've been waiting so long, so long to get this stream deck. Um, and honestly, just having it, just having that icon right there that we just set up literally makes it so much easier. Um, but um, I'm going to relax the um, rest of the day. Uh, maybe play around with this, um, get a couple more buttons set up, a couple more folders, um, you know, check out some other videos, tutorials on how to set things up. 
Uh, that way, next time we stream, it'll look a lot better, feel a lot better, go a lot smoother. Um, as you guys can see, that transition we just did from ending to coming back to the gameplay, that was smooth. I literally didn't even have to move my mouse over, click on the other screen, make that disappear, nothing. Like, that, just having to drag over, click that, then go back over, click this screen again, make sure the audio is going. Now I don't have to worry about that. We, we are good. So, uh, if you guys have any recommendations on certain keys I should have on my 15 key Stream Deck MK2, please let me know either down below, uh, on Twitter, on Instagram, um, anything. Just let me know, guys. I appreciate you guys stopping by, and I will see you guys in the next one. Guess what?